must report immediately. What has happened? The Paladin have been attacked. There is an armed revolt. You don't need to report that. Melvin is already handling matters. What is wrong, Belder River Handler? Your face is blue. Tis nothing. What's wrong? I feel dizzy. So you must be Melvin's Shadow Knight. Mercedes. If I kill this girl, Melvin's plan will be complete. No, I had better wait for Melvin's command. Pardon me. I'm not feeling well. Knowing that the Demon Lord is on his way here makes me nervous. Do you think that girl can fulfill her duties as queen in these times of strife? Her cousin Melvin is quite dependable. He ought to take her place. It's suddenly very complicated here. I wonder if it's safe to be here. You again. I told you to stay away. Do you fight for the late queen? Of course. That is a knight's sworn duty. Then beware the darkness. Send that letter to the lords. A just cause will be needed to fight the rebels. Oswald, explain the situation. As you command, paladins who were in opposition have hidden themselves in secrecy. There is now nobody left who publicly opposes you. Good work. Those stubborn lords still cling to sentimental ideas of Elfaria's daughter ruling. But some have expressed approval in the thought of me in charge of affairs. I am in command of a good third of our troops. But I am running out of time. Lord Melvin! You have acted recklessly! Tell them we will face their so-called revolution. We will break their resolve. If we can stifle the girl and her forces in the castle, the masses will follow us. Respectfully, a sorcerer and a dragon have been sworn to protect the queen. Beldor, huh? I wonder what his motive is. He is a tricky one. Fear not. I shall present a champion that can defeat any dragon. Lord Melvin! Does such a warrior even exist in this world of ours? Mock me not, coward. My man is right here. Now go, Oswald. <sighs> it's getting worse. Ever since I saw the Halya, my body is stiff. But I must do what Melvin asks of me. I can still do this. Oh, <laughs> 
my life. Oh, I thought you were a bandit. Uh, you have such an evil glare. Ha! 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 Ha!
Oh, 
I'm an innocent bystander. I'm just a nice goblin. Just don't ask where my wares came from. <laughs> Governor, a pleasure to meet you. Surely you cannot rest with a tense look like that. Would you like to try a meal that will put a smile on your face? Huh? A new recipe. Allow me to add it to the menu. Now then, what do you want to order? for the wait. Is there anything else you want to order? As you wish. for the wait. Beldor. I serve Lord Melvin, nephew of the late Queen. Oswald, the Dragon Slayer. What brings you here? Beldor, the greatest sorcerer in the Fairy Kingdom. Let me ask, are you loyal to a country or to a single individual? Hmm, so that's why you are here. Melvin must have decided. This will be entertaining. 
But alas, I am an outsider. It troubles me that I am relied on here. Until the course of events calms down apace, I shall observe from afar. Can you just stand by and let this nation sink into civil war? I hope you don't plan on threatening me with that sword. Let me help you make your decision a bit easier. Who do you think will be more advantageous to side with? Bastard! Controlling the dragon. The sorcerer complied with Melvin's orders. But the curse continued to weaken my body. My Belder Reaver was not at full strength. And the revolution was near failure. The troops are in shambles. What shall we do? They have reinforcements! The palace has already been surrounded! I suppose random assaults proved to be an effective strategy in this situation. Our revolution ended in failure. Where has Lord Melvin gone? Let us escape. To whence? We have nowhere to run! How could that lass have proved better than me? Melvin, is that you? My eyes... My eyes are clouding. I, I cannot see. Then it seems your time is almost up. You worthless fool. Breaking down like this. I should have prepared a replacement to take the Belder River away from you. A replacement? Melvin, did you really trade my life for the Belder River? <laughs> no, it is a lie. <laughs> what exactly am I to you? Answer me, Melvin! <laughs> You? You are simply an object. Just a tool for me to become king. No. There he is! Over here! You cannot escape, Melvin the traitor. <clears throat> it seems my life is nearing its end. 
O oh, great earth, my body returns to you. O oh, heavens, my soul ascends. I called myself Melvin. My true name is Needog, the one that chews on the roots of the ash tree. I will always resist fate. I... What meaning has my life ever had? Halt! Holder of the Belted Reaver! Don't move! What is that? Ah! It's the Halya! Pitiful Slayer. The life I chased was merely an illusion. Your despair brings me joy. Your body rots while living, yet your true destiny does not awaken until you die. Now let me take you into the cold embrace of death.